I'm Susan Page, Washington Bureau Chief of USA Today. Congress is debating a sweeping immigration bill on Capitol Hill, and Americans are clearly listening. They've been persuaded by both sides. We have a new nationwide USA Today Pew Research Center poll. Three-fourths of the people we surveyed agree with the big arguments made by those who want to provide a way for the estimated 11 million immigrants now in the country illegally to stay here. They agree that deporting them isn't realistic, that granting them legal status would boost the economy, that most are hardworking and deserve an opportunity to stay. But we also found that two-thirds of Americans also agree with the big arguments made by opponents, that granting these undocumented immigrants legal status would drain government services, and that doing so would encourage more foreigners to come here illegally. So where does that leave things? Some analysts say it could make it harder to reach a final deal this year. Achieving all these different priorities in a bill may be difficult. And both sides may feel they can draw a harder line in the sand because they can argue most Americans agree with them. In our poll, 77% said they thought border security should be tightened. 71% said there should be a way for undocumented immigrants to stay here legally if they meet certain conditions. We ask about some of those possible conditions. There's broad support for the idea that the immigrants should have to speak and understand English first. That was endorsed by three of four people. And solid majority said they should have to pay a fine and wait for 10 years before they can become permanent legal residents. For more on the USA Today Pew Research Center poll, go to usatoday.com.